Hello everyone. Internal reference sequence module allow users to set a sequence based on and product category. After installing this module, now let's get into the inventory. Over here in the configuration, we can see and product categories. So over here, let's get into one of the category or create a new category. So in this, I'm going to create a category named wood products. Okay. So I have created one category. Now, in this, I have created a category. Over here, we can see a two options. One is to active. So, here, if you enable this one, this will be in the active state. So, after we enabling this, this category will be in the drop down of the products. Now, in this, we need to choose a sequence. Now, for this, I'm going to create a new sequence. So, let's create a new sequence for an wood product. So over here, I'm just creating a new one. Now, in this, we need to give a code and other more information like prefix, suffix, and sequence steps and also the next number which will be. Now, you can add a prefix. Now, I'm going to add a wood products. And at last, it must show a value like 0, 1. Okay, this will be the value and in this i'm going to give a uh, sequence size as five and the step will be starts from one now let's save this one okay now let me save the category over here now let's get into the products over here just getting into one of the product which we have created now in this i'm going to add and product category as i already told you like from here you can see and product category which will be in the active state for those category we have enabled an active state so now in this it will list out all the active state products categories okay now in this i just choose a product category and i'm going to save this one so once you have saved you can see that internal reference is automatically created so you can see wp prefix and also the digits and here it comes in suffix so in this way we can make use of this module to so in this way we can make use of this module to allow user to set in sequence based on and product category for a product if you have any queries regarding this video, you can ask in the comment box. We will definitely solve your queries. And if you feel this video is helpful to you, you can like this video and subscribe our YouTube channel for more Oro related updates. Thank you for watching.